previously on Cyberpunk 2077. I know things. Where we can save your life, you'll get rid of the chip. I'll smash Sokka. This time, Bomb's named Alta Cunningham. Let's get her somewhere safe. Really didn't want to poke around in her head. I'll show you the virtue I found. Leave, Margie. Sort of who might use them, though. Who? Could be the Voodoo Boys. The spine chilling Netrunner crew? There's one more recording. My name is Kwame Javeo. Need to make contact with the Voodoo Boys chief, Maman Brigitte. Our interest is now in the GIM, the Grand Imperial Mall. You do for us only one simple thing. We try to learn where the camionette come from. We have now seen the police who are with us. Step away now. This isn't your fight. The runner know you are here. Continue. Just severed the connection to the rest of Pacifica. Who are you? Bryce Mosley, Netwatch Special Agent. Can we talk? Brigitte and her lapdog T Neptune have been frozen several days now. You were sent here to free them. Do you know why they didn't tell you everything? Because you're a random floor rat. When you're no longer needed, they chuck you. Got anything to back that claim? They did it already. Soon as you handed over your link, slipped in the Spectre and a virus. I'll fish the voodoo virus out of your system. And I'll release both Brigitte and T Neptune. And all you gotta do is let us walk with our data. Okay, do it. Brigitte and the other guy, are they back? Yes, Mama B is awake. Perfect, because I got to talk to him. Hello everyone, and welcome back to another episode of Cyberpunk 2077. So we're back here at the Voodoo Boys headquarters, I suppose, to meet with Placide and after I basically saved their boss, I guess. So let's continue with the story. What's up, man? Cool gun. What the fuck you do in the GIM? You were to hack the agent, not cut deal with him. Well, you tried to set me up. Do that to every merc you hire. Try to set him up. Cool that son. You believe that fachis? What he say? You say, or I open you. See with my own eye what won't crawl under. I can take you on. I fucking dare you. I say, we must head under. I do not know what Netwatch plans, but they are not done. You worried about agents? Then shoot him in the head. I do not know what they put in him. What corruption is in his system. You don't know what is in there to begin with. How much it is worth. I know. I stand him. Only a normal filthy rider. Ali. Yeah, run away. Come with me. You must be Brigitte. Hard woman to find. You have something for me. You know about the biochip, don't you? If it is functional, we offer you good price for it. That's not exactly how it works, but okay. That why you're talking to me now? Cause you know I got the biochip? Not cause I saved your frozen ass. If I was any ordinary Ranyan, you'd have dealt with me already. Placid saw in you common trash from the streets. This is why he chose you. But you knew about the chip, and still put yourself in danger in the gym. <laughs> Just like you. Only I came out of there on my own. Yeah, it's not for sale. Biochip's busted. That's why I'm here. Haven't found a single soul capable of getting this thing out of me without scrambling my brain. You commissioned the heist. So I figured you must know something. You've got it. How do you know all this? How did you find us? Yeah, remember the girl you fried? Evelyn Parker. Name ring a bell? Ah, the doll. The whore. You found us because she led you to us. She has proved not completely useless after all. Listen, can you help me or not? Yes, of course, but not here. We will go to the crib, where you must give us access to the jeep. Once we have the data we need, we will do our best to help you. Seriously? Haven't done enough for you already? There is no other way. 
To remove it, we must first examine it. Because if you fuck up, you're left empty-handed. That it? I gave my word. We will help you. I don't really have any other options right now, except for Takemura. So, I suppose, yeah. Then, after you. You guys sure seem to love this place. But honestly, you don't give off a strong religious vibe. We left our gods on Aiti. Yet we are strong here without them. Yeah, you had a weird ass funeral. This way. So. So how come Placide didn't know about the biochip? He didn't recognize it in the scans. Few of our people know about Compeki Tower, but Placide, he is. Your bet de bas. I don't know what that means. I'm assuming someone stupid. <laughs> Where are we going? Soon you will see. Okay. I did not notice the biochip in you. Strange. Did you let him scan you? Hmm? No. Why? It would complicate our work. There's an old subway tunnel? No. Part of the transcontinental maglev system. When all states were connected. Like the net, it too crumbled after the war. View a courant. And I thought they were sketchy. This just puts them on another level. Tout le bagage paré. Nous qu'a commencé. Bon. We take you into the cyberspace. No better place for you to interact with the construct. Uh-huh. How do I know I'll come back? Do I get some guarantee? You will be inside our data fortress. Under watch. Under your watch. If you knew what is out there in the cyberspace, you would not be so choosy. You already crossed me once, so don't really trust you at this point. How's all this any different from plain old net running? The interface show you the data layers direct from the net. Readable, of course. But the basic runner see is only a map. They cannot see beneath the surface. Their tech, it is too weak. Yeah, what do you want from Johnny? Okay, hang on. I want to know what you need Silverhand for first. We wish to contact Alt Cunningham. We know she and Silverhand were close. Alt? The relic which Arasaka held close. It is our only lead. Alt Cunningham. Heard of her? Oh. Where? From whom? From that guy. From Johnny. Though granted, not much. Johnny? All right, V. Guess you better tell her. Tell her what? About us. Yeah, he's pretty much alive. In a certain point of view. Construct's active. Let's me and Johnny shoot the shit every now and then. Mm-hmm. You can look at this, too. What? Think I'm hallucinating? Found myself an imaginary friend? Little is known of how an engram might exist within a human's neural network. I'll tell you one thing, it doesn't shake out well for the human. What's your plan to contact Alt? We try to cut out a unique piece of Silverhand's engram from the biochip. Alt will know it. If something of the human is left after years beyond the Black Wall, she will answer. Well, what? You said nothing about breaking through the Black Wall. Well, now you know. Direction yeah. connected. Connection What exactly are we gonna do? Why Let's you wait? Get out of here. The ice will melt waiting for your decision. What exactly do you want from Alt? 
All of you. Alt the only one can give us safe passage past the Black Wall. When the change come, we wish to be on the winning side. The change? When the Black Wall was built, everyone think the ice would be enough. Keep the wild AIs out, away. But technology advances, it cannot be stopped. And now, catastrophe come again. This is sure, and soon. The corporations, they do not see the danger. But we, we will be ready. Uh-huh. The Black Wall. What is it exactly? I mean, I know... You know only what the Netwatch tell you. The final bastion against the post-war AIs. The great victory of humanity over chaos. That would be your Saturday morning Netwatch propaganda. But the Black Wall is an AI itself. The boundary condition let no thing pass through, either way. If the AIs thought like people, they would call it a traitor. Okay. Johnny, looks like you're the bait. You okay with that? Yeah, whatever. Just do what she says. Gotta get in that. Oh, come on. Not the tub. We must prepare you for the dive into cyberspace. You are not accustomed to the neural demand. Don't try and get out of this, V. Just do what she says. I'm not about to sizzle with you. Why are you all of a sudden, like, game on this? Okay. Let's do this. <laughs> okay. What now? Johnny? Prepare. Prepare, plonge. Okay. Freaky. So this is cyberspace? Technically we've been here before. <laughs> when V died, I think. Where are we? This is our BBS, Data Fortress. Bridge to the deep net. It's, it's all so alive, so real. Cyberspace moves, breathes at all times. The interface will adjust the ebb and flow of data to the capabilities of your brain. But you, you are an exceptional case. Seeing something more than I am. Yes, the cyberspace, it is always trop belle. Looks like Christmas lights. So, what now? We can begin. All is ready. We enhance your link to Silverhand's neural network for a short time to grab the fragment. We must find the data on Alt. Alt alone. This should only take. Twenty thirteen. We go all the way back. This is way back. What's happening? Okay. So another flashback. So 
So we're gonna be Johnny again. did he do <laughs> it's not your pain you're no solo act samurai you kind of are though only one to have a problem with me because everyone else has had it up to here they're done thinking they can get through to you you're fucking whacked you shoot guns at the concert <laughs> You know exactly why I do it. No, nah. -uh. To piss Arasaka off enough so they'll give you a case of deep muscle lead poisoning? But I'm the only one with a vision. So unless you got a better one, like I said, go fuck yourself. Fuck. Is it the concert or Carrie? Hmm? Said you weren't coming tonight. Not if I can help it. Changed my mind, lover. Look at you, all hot and bothered. Ooh. So we're gonna witness some sexy time. Oh, the physics in that is so bad. <laughs> the music supposed to fade out goodness gracious me mm -hmm. a damn shame that's that What, smoking after sex not zen enough for you? We gotta rewrite the art of war, too? We're done, Johnny. With it all. I just... couldn't ghost without saying... something. So go on, say it. You can be such a bastard sometimes, Johnny. Man, are you on my ass today? Not just today. How is it subtlety goes so far over your head? Weird for an artist. Things were swimming. What? Change your mind? Eats at my gut. Cause you knew what you were signing up for. Look, if you were just another charismatic, narcissistic douche canoe running around after his dream with his head up his ass, I couldn't care less. But? It's all a lie. That concert, samurai, all of it. A ginormous fiction. You're not a rocker boy, Johnny. Face it. Ought to join the wired wackos on the corners, frothing at the mouth as they scream death to Arasaka. I see. Think you've seen through me, do you? You know exactly what I mean. Look at you, faking it even to yourself. <laughs> Probably what you're best at, faking it.
You're confused. We came here to fuck each other's brains out, not analyze mine. Mm, you're afraid. You and Carrie both. Cowards. I alone have the balls to stand up to Arasaka, and boy, that terrifies you. All of you. Of course, Johnny S. Misunderstood by all Night City. That's it. That's the problem. I think we're done for the day, so you can fuck off. See, I thought... That this meant something, that we're close? So close you can give me shit about everything I do? Got quite the imagination then. Goodness, Johnny's an asshole. Complete douchebag. Where are you going? Got somewhere to be. Silverhand! Hey! Good noise, Chum. Shoots around when I come on done. Save it. I don't know for who. Can't kill because there's words. Plays away. So how long you think Another you're gonna be mad? Man. Let's get out of here. Join us for a drop. Silver Rocker. Another time, Chumbas. But what if there won't be another time? Huh? Johnny boy. Fuck off! Leave me alone! Johnny! What the hell? Did they just kill Johnny? Fuck off! Let me alone! Johnny! Let go of me! That was one hell of a stab. <laughs> stab is an understatement. He got impaled. Okay, who was that? Come on, rise and shine. Been a while, Johnny boy. How long did you say? Two weeks since I last cobbled you up? Man, did I miss you. Ugh. Bullshit, you gonk son of a bitch. Didn't even bother to call. You were supposed to be back for your follow-up. Kid's like a son to me. So I see. So you like, uh, Victor? How's it look down there? Well... Shove so many tubes up your ass that you're about two mods off from pissing espresso and milk froth. Also tossed in a synthetic liver. Old one was looking worse than a paper bag full of shit. Great. Now I can live forever. Just as well. Where's Alt? Where's who? Woman who was with me. He brought you and you alone. Fuck, they grabbed her. Nobody saw it? Ask your savior. Said his name was Thompson. That you back there and what? We gotta talk. All right. It's spit and glue, but she's holding tight. Get some rest. Even a few hours, that the stitches set at least. Uh-huh. Johnny. Yeah, fuck it. You won't listen anyway. 
<laughs> so talk. They wanted her. You. You was just home. And you just stood there, dick in hand, gawking and dreaming of tomorrow. Would have shredded us both if I jumped in. You see the guy's reflexes? Course not. He was that fast. Tech like that, you don't find in a dumpster. Yeah, what's your motive? So, what are you after? Chasing down a story? Fresh for the scream sheets? That why you scraped me up off the pavement? Nah, had my story. But then some cats tossed her in the back of a van and sped off. You, uh, aim to do something about it? She was your output, wasn't she? Not your fucking business. Hmm, not sure, huh? Yeah, heard there was tension, assorted goings on. Honestly, could not care less about your fluttering hearts and loins. I want to know why Arasaka bagged her. Alt's kidnapping, it's collateral shit. They swiped her to get at me. You even know what she does for a living? Girl's one of the best runners around. So, one of how many? No, only linked to Arasaka's the fact that Johnny Silver and boning her. Well, she's been working for ITS lately. Wrote some real smooth black eyes for them. Not to be duped in either sense of the term. Okay, so she's a big deal? I don't think Johnny would lean on someone. Arasaka wants her. Abduction was a standard intercorp extraction. Nothing more. Hang on. Oh, was gonna meet you tonight. Mm-hmm. Said you could use my help. Wasn't kidding. Sokka tried this before, you know. Except all got lucky. Slipped through their mantis blades. Telling me she was afraid. And she went to you. Yep. And frankly, I'm starting to see why. What do they want from her? Okay, so what are they after? Soul killer. An AI. Sound familiar at all? Of course. Urban legend with the shittiest name ever. It's no legend. Soul Killer's real. And your Chumbas at Arasaka just hired the runner who wrote it. Take that in. Sokka with Soul Killer to do with as it pleases. Grim, my man. You even imagine that, Rocker? Arasaka will be unstoppable. Soul Killer will flatline any runner who comes close to even trying to scratch its eyes. Seen it happen. Not an iota of physical damage nervous system or anywhere else no sound no fury no stench just all of a sudden brain waves cut out as if someone pulled the plug or ripped the soul from the body in question that was a lot of information what a steaming load of shit let's go okay what's your take then I'm all ears oldest tritest tale in the world Arasaka was out to provoke me, and it worked. Johnny's one big narcissist, isn't he? <laughs> okay, that's time to go. So what'll it be? Coming with? Where to? Arasaka Tower. To grab Alt, right back. Just you and me? You out of your fucking mind? Mm-hmm. Nope. Let's grab the others. Wherever they are. Still waiting. Swing by the Atlantis on the way. Got some chooms there. 